What's up, YouTube? So Kamala Harris faces more allegations of plagiarism? What the hell's going on? What's up, YouTube? I'm Corey, and welcome to my channel, Let's Talk with Corey. If this is your first time tuning in, hit that subscribe button. But before we get into it, wherever you are in this world today, I mean wherever you are in the world today, I really do hope you're having a great day day guys my channel is for grown folks and if this is your first time tuning in again hit that subscribe button this article comes via the daily mail and it says kamala harris faces more allegations of plagiarism after book bombshell follow along with me it says that kamala harris has been rocked by yet another plagiarism scandal after potential damning allegations have surfaced about testimony she delivered as a U.S. Senator. Harris is accused of lifting text verbatim from a former colleague, say it ain't so, for use in written congressional testimony that she gave in 2007. Um, and the latest allegations about Harris come on the heels of, a, of another scandal over whether she worked at McDonald's in college, as she's claimed. Good grief. I mean, come on, guys. Who would? Who cares? Uh, both, <laughs> both come after she was previously accused of copying word for word several bl blocks of text in her book, Smart on Crime, published in 2009. I mean, isn't it 2024? Who would care? Uh, okay, but anyway, anything they can dig up, anything they can dig up. Um, the latest plagiarism allegations arise from testimony Harris gave as a senator, senator in support of the John R. Justice Prosecutors and Defendants in Incentive Act of 2007. It was a bill that would help pay student loans for state and federal prosecutors to keep talented lawyers in the profession. Not a bad thing, right? It says further states that Harris' interest in the proposal was personal as she spent her early years as a career prosecutor before she ran for political office. But her written statement in support of the bill sent the House Judiciary Committee uh, was not about her own experience, so says the article. Instead, it reflected nearly verbatim text, 300 words in the testimony, 80% were exactly the same as uh, a Logley's submission, according to the Free Beacon analysis. It is unclear whether the political figures were using the same source text to write their testimony. So you guys don't even know. Says the similarity could have resulted from sloppy staff work. Uh, plagiarism accusations can derail a political campaign if the candidate is found to have intentionally copied another politician's uh, for a dramatic effect. Uh, Joe Biden, first presidential campaign in 1987, was derailed by plagiarism accusation as he appeared to copy a story from a, a British Labor Party politician. He was also accused of plagiarism in law school. New plagiarism report places new emphasis on Harris's use of other people's work as she was found to have plagiarized several blocks of text in her book smart on crime uh, that she published with co-author Joan O.C. Hamilton. The allegations were uncovered by author and activist Christopher Rufo, who published details of passages in question in early October. All right, guys, that's, that's all I got on that. I mean, I don't really see there's no meat on the bone. Uh, in my opinion, again, this stuff is coming out. This was I think this was dated October 21st Daily Mail's article. Now what's your thoughts about, you know, these allegations of plagiarism? You know, could it be simple similarities or is it, you know, using somebody else's work as your own and that's not a good thing. You guys leave a comment. Hit that subscribe button and as always, thanks for the pull up. Let's talk with Corey. Let's talk with Corey out.